So I was at the river and I saw these beautiful reeds. They kind of look, kind of look like bamboo. And apparently they're called the Rundodonyx or giant reed. Anyway, I saw them and I decided I wanted to take them some cuttings, bring them home and see if I could figure out how to propagate them. And so here's my adventure. All right, so I took the cuttings. And as you can see, this is what an undeveloped node looks like. There's a small little embryo right there. <clears throat> can see that <clears throat> and hopefully those develop out and we'll see what happens in a few days all right it's been a few days and i checked on them and it looks like some of these are growing some of these nodes are expanding out absorbing water and starting to develop there's one there it's swelling up a little bit so they're looking good probably let them sit for another day or two and check on them and see what happens all right so here i am a couple more days later and they've really grown. And look at those. They swelled a lot. I'm really surprised that they're growing so fast. And you can kind of see like little roots trying to develop underneath those nodes. Underneath those buds. It's pretty cool. And I did two versions. I did one in plastic all by itself with water. And then I did another one right next to it that has soil underneath it. Just in case there was trace materials in the soil that they might need to develop. So... That's kind of curious. Looks like this one, you can really see the little root forming, which is pretty cool. And you'll notice that those nodes are always on opposite sides of the cane. And I realized I could probably just divide these up. I could probably chop these up. So the point in between the nodes is called an internode. And I believe you could probably slice them up. The problem is, is the pressure of the scissors you use causes the canes to crack and I'm worried that those ca those cracks are going to travel up the cane and somehow damage the node. So I did another experiment that I'll show you in just a minute because I was kind of curious if the node needed to be intact. So if you'll notice over here, I, I chopped some up. And these ones seem to be doing fine, but the total node is actually still intact. You'll notice right here, I actually broke off the bud from the node just to see if it would survive because I was kind of curious if it could live without the whole node, if it just needed that piece of tissue. And so we'll see if that can actually grow by itself. So pretty fun experiment, and this stuff grows so well. I'm surprised it's developing so fast. I mean, these look at these nodes. They're just really, these buds are really growing. Kind of a fun little experiment. I don't know if I'm actually going to put them in my yard or not, but it's really cool to watch them grow. Anyway, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Have a good day.